Hello folks and welcome to Best Choice Trailers and RVs in Irwin, Pennsylvania, 724-864-1449. Today folks, we're looking at a Micro Life by Flagstaff. It is a premium brand across the boards, across the world and country. This camper has probably more standard options than anything currently built today. Let's go over a majority of them. Starting off with our front cap, we have a painted front gel coat type cap, and it is painted. Automotive styled glass that fits the cap itself. We have an outside decorative light fixture LED. Always standard two 30 pound tanks, even on a 25 FKS, which this is. Front power jack with light, and you do have a dual battery box it comes with. It also comes with a battery disconnect switch. Going down the side of the camper, the interesting thing about um, Flagstaff is they call it key alike. So instead of having seven or eight keys, 751, whatnot, this key, this coach comes with two keys. That's one and a duplicate. Each key opens all your compartment doors and your main doors. It's a great thing. You're down to one key for your camper. So that's key to like, and they're not 751, so not every key will work in the hole. So going back to that, we have our forward storage in the kitchen area, underneath the kitchen area, I should say. You have your PS2 retractable extendable power jacks underneath. Again, what's different between PS2 and regular electric jacks, this is a dual motor drive system with heavy duty bars and suspension that help out to navigate those stabilizers. And they only do stabilize, they do not level, but they're very efficient, very fast, and with the dual motor, technology they last a lot longer coming down to the door side we've got basically our screen door here and it's got what they call a screenshot and a screenshot's a simple device and it is a patent by Lippert and once you release the door the door is to close itself you'll not see that on a bunch of campers in fact the only thing I carry here is a flagstaff that has that product on it the door has a sweep on it as well as a heavy bulb seal for sealing and the the steps are the uh, step above so there's two types one that is a manual lift up that weighs about 25 pounds and then you have the hydraulic cylinder the deluxe model which these steps can be picked up by simply one finger one finger control all the way up you don't have to worry about them coming out hitting anything that's down here you unleash it, it's going to come down. You actually have to pull them down, and at midpoint, they become zero weight. Very nice product. Oversized grab handle bar, and again, like I said, 25 front kitchen on this model. We're 26 foot, 11 inches, stem to stern. That's front to the Continental Tire Kit in the rear. The weight on it is 59.88. So at 59.88, it does a lot for you there. Towability for any half ton that's out there. Um, check your tow guides to find out exactly what you tow, but there's a lot of them. Coming down the sidewall, they give you a bracket on the side of the camper. This bracket is for your TV that's inside standard. The interesting design you see here is a V bracket. You physically pick the TV up inside and you put the TV down on this bracket in here. That's all it takes. You just screw the cable into here, the plug into here, there's no tools involved, and you have outside TV in less than five minutes. This rail out here is for your griddle, which it comes with. The quick connect is underneath the camper itself, as well as a small stainless table. Those things can be left outside, obviously, because they're metal, and uh, they're not for mica tables that if they get wet, you could have a problem. Looking on the side of the camper, we've got our outside sound, our LED lit awning, and of course, the awning is a power awning. Looking down to here, what we've got is Dexter axles. So these are mounted in rubber, they're independent. They're not on uh, springs, which has a lot more road bounce. These track better, they handle better, they treat tires better. And speaking of tires, these have Goodyear Endurance tires on them. The most sought after trailer tire today. And so these aren't what you think they are, it's not China bombs, these are physical good tires, look them up. If you're looking for replacements for your own, this is what I, I would choose to get for my own. So moving down to the outside kitchen, we have an outside 110 refrigerator, as well as the hose that goes outside for the spray port. Spray port hose is a coil hose, 15 foot, comes with a spray head. 
They always don't come to spray head. With the Flagstaff product, it does. Your outside grill top or stove top is a dual stove top. Again, that's a quick connect under the body for the LP, which comes off your main tanks. That's why you have 30 pounds of LP. Going to the rear of the coach, this is that spray port area here. And again, deluxe. So most spray ports are just cold. This is hot and cold. So we can do anything hot or cold from right here with the spray port hose. The hot water tank is a DSI six gallon electric gas. Going around to the back of the camper, we've got a nice simple port area here. City water connection, an antifreeze inlet because these can be winterized from the exterior. And again, they make the process simple and without you having to hunt down where your water pump is and whatnot. And then your cable satellite are located here. Here's an interesting thing. So on a hot day like today, me and John are out here doing videos. It's 88 degrees, it's mid-July. You could do anything you wanna do with this cargo carrier. It is a molded plastic cargo carrier. From what I understand, it holds up to about 75 beverages of your choice. So you could actually use it for a cooler. It comes completely out. You can put it on the ground. You can use it for about anything or simple storage. Fantastic idea. Always thinking about space that you can't reach that they can put something in to give you more storage. Factory rear ladder, always a factory rear ladder. So again, five side aluminum, everything's aluminum well bond, facu bond. Uh, the, the build on these are fantastic. You have the LED lights all the way around and you can put a optional backup camera on it if you want. Your back black tank flush is located here. Your 30 amp cord would plug in here and your fresh water tank is here. Note the frameless glass gives it a fantastic look and appeal. They're very functional. They open jealousy style, so they open up at the bottom. Can be left open during the rain. It's just a fantastic concept and a beautiful look. As we come down the side of the camper, as we back up, we can see it comes with a slide top. Slide top for the cover, make sure no debris gets on top of it. Very great idea. We actually have sell these. We have a sale on the slide toppers right now, right here at Best Choice RVs. Our area in the center for storage is located right here. As you can look in, you can see some of the aluminum construction. The floors are all five, five eighths, uh, tongue and groove uh, plywood. No structure wood on your flooring. And all your doors are going to be ma magnetic. So, very nice. Coming to the forward section, we have an outside shower with hot and cold running water as well. So we've got hot and cold on both sides, five foot hose in this one, 15 on the other. We have areas that we can wash things off front and back. So let's go inside and take a look at some of those features, shall we? Front kitchen, obviously normally front kitchen has more kitchen than anything. Rear bath has more rear bath than anything and so on and so forth. So in a small coach like this, we've got a numerous amount of storage areas that are highly usable for your cupboards. They're deep. Your wood doors are all solid wood doors. European hinges on all of the doors. Seals better, closes better, feels better. Solid surface countertops, one piece. Stainless steel sinks, full size baskets. You have your cutting board and your dish drying and you have a single lever faucet for hot and cold water control. Note they use a slow rise shade in the camper. Very nice feature there. They always give you a 22 inch oven with sight glass. So it's always gonna be name brand, Magic Chef here. Magic Chef on the microwave. So it's it's not some imported brand that's nobody ever heard of before. They use tested and true tried appliances in the Flagstaff micro line. So we see the microwave. Um, moving around to the slide out, we have a full U booth, which does fold down into a sleeping area. It has a table. And this table actually can be moved around. It can be moved outside. It actually folds down to be a coffee table. So you have those two choices where it becomes part of the bed. 
So, very great feature. Which a lot of manufacturers are getting away from. These refrigerators are gas electric. They are 10 cubic foot. Uh, you have a, a, ch a chance to operate on 110 or propane gas. And oh, what do we have here? TST tire monitoring, standard. It's wireless tire monitoring. You can monitor your tires or pressures and things of that nature right from your truck going down the highway. If there's an issue, it will alert you of that. Great feature, standard. Full central air, and they'll run double ducts. So instead of running a single duct work front and back, this will be a, a duct work where you'll have ducts running two vents all the way down through the whole camper. That's a little different, more efficient, more quiet, and it's a 15K. So you have an upgrade, smaller camper, but I think probably most important thing is they do run a four and a quarter inch thick poured foam roof with four inch aluminum weld um, uh, framework. And then they basically make that like a sidewall so it's compressed and then molded, put on like a cap. So these roofs can withstand way more thousands of pounds than a standard conventional built wood roof, uh, which would be 16 on center. Uh, and the insulation factor goes way up because it's basically solid core foam with uh, some uh, some aluminum to make it rigid so that's a big feature we had the fireplace in this one which you have the fireplace it's got a timer you can change the colors but again more importantly electric heat from this so you have a furnace but to take off the chill on those chilly nights it's got the 5000 BTU furnace or electric electric heater that does a lot of a good for you They'll run a sound bar system for the inside sound. It also does outside sound, your choice, Bluetooth, CD player right here, DVD. It's hooked into the TV that can go inside or out. So going down the hallway, we go into the restroom. We've got our glass shower, magnetic. Ooh, need Wheaties today. And as you can see, I'm six foot one, and I have plenty of clearance at six one. And uh, it's a lot of room to work in here. Uh, it's, a, it's a great thing. Oh, China toilet. So you got a China toilet, regular top, nice large medicine cabinet. Fantastic vent fan. That's third horsepower fan, 10 blade. It will draw air through your windows like you can't believe. It's a fantastic item, especially in the bathroom. Back here, this basically is your inversion. This is where you're going to work with your inverter. It does have a solar panel on the roof factory. It does have a thousand watt inverter. So there's a certain amount of times and there's a certain amount of power that you can draw, convert it to 110 from your batteries off grid, monitor that energy through this device and be able to operate some 110 appliances as well as your 12 volt system. Very, very excellent idea. They give you the whole thing. It's not plugged or plugged for solar it's not ready for solar it is solar so that's a great feature on this high-end premium camper going back to our bedroom area we have a full 60 by 80 bed plenty of cabinets across the top again slow rise blinds plank of hanging space on either side We have USB charge points at both sides. We also have 110 for both sides. And each individual outlet, it's marked inverter capable. That means that inverter will give you 110 power to everything marked. And right here, I can tell you there's two. There's a lot more in here than that, but there's more than two. The back here, we have a nice area here. It's plumbed for a second TV, some more catch-all storage and storage below. This is on our 2022 2022 clearance sale here at Best Choice RVs. Come out and see us. Thank you very much.